How can I evolve when everything seems to be dissolving right in front of me? How can I make it through the night? How can I have what I need? How can I grow more in prosperity? How can I achieve a level of well-being and health and harmony and wholeness in my life when it seems as though everything is topsy-turvy? And something within you knows that there are answers to those basic but yet profound questions. Something within you knows that within you is the answer. Something within you knows that if you keep on asking the right question, if you keep on digging, if you keep on searching, you'll eventually bump into the answer and ultimately you will discover it that it's with you all of the time. Ultimately, you'll begin to discover who you are. In this moment, you can think independent of any circumstances going on in your life. Right this moment, as you're sitting here listening to me, there may be some issue that you're seeking to solve. There may be some problem you're trying to overcome. There may be some sense of discomfort that you're trying to free yourself from. And as you're sitting here listening to me right now, you're thinking independent of that experience. And that means you are exercising the faculty that you have with the universal presence to think independent of any issue that's going on and enter into a co-creative relationship with this presence and ultimately change your life. So in substance, what I'm saying, that you're not the body, you have a body. You're not the mind, you have a mind. That you are an avenue of awareness that is conscious of the body. You're an avenue of awareness that's conscious of the mind. And as you begin to expand your awareness as to who and what you really are, you get to make choices that liberate you from limitation, liberate you from disease, liberate you from discomfort, liberate you from poverty and lack and limitation. Choice is actually a function of ever-expanding awareness. And as you begin to have certain practices in your life, certain heart sets and mind sets, you will begin to make the great discovery that all of the power and presence and love, prosperity, abundance, joy, spontaneous goodness, happiness, all of the things that seem so fleeting, that seem to be outside of yourself, just outside of your grasp, you'll begin to discover that they are deep within you waiting to escape. That you're not here to get them, that you are here to let them. You're not here to get it, you're here to let it flow by making high choices from an expanded awareness as to who and what you really are. You no longer need to be a victim to circumstance. You no longer need to be a victim to the past. You no longer have to be a victim to a future in which you are projecting negativity. You no longer have to be a victim to anything that anyone has ever said about you. You no longer have to be a victim to the things that you've said about yourself. You no longer have to be a victim to anything that through your expanded awareness of this dynamic and magnificent presence, through the expanded awareness, you get to make a choice. You get to make a choice to become more yourself and anchor on earth in time and space the eternal qualities of love and of beauty and of well-being. You're not the constellation of changing personalities that are forged into being based on circumstances in your life. But who you are is a unique emanation of something so wonderful and so magnificent that by means of you wants to come into expression, wants to reveal itself. And these transcendent yet imminent qualities that we call love, and that we call beauty, and that we call harmonizing prosperity, and that we call abundance, and that we call living intelligence. By means of you, they want to express themselves. The whispering in your ear saying, let me be free. Set me free today. Allow me to come forward and express myself. And you are here to in some way make a choice to say yes 